It's candy time. Today I'm walking the candy aisle. Hey everyone, my name is Jeff and today I have a review for you of some uh, classic, one might say, hard candies. This is the Pergula line of hard candies. And I'll tell you, you know, sometimes when I'm doing these reviews, I, I enjoy the hunt, the, the tracking down of the information of, of what the candies are and who they're from. This is not one of those cases. This is, in fact, one of those times when I found it really difficult to figure out who actually makes these candies. You might recognize these. I mean, like, I would say that these have been standard fare um, hard candies for waiting rooms <laughs> all over the place. I feel like for years and years and years, uh, like probably since I was a kid. I, I don't know, maybe I'm misremembering, but I feel like I've seen these these candies specifically, these one, these kind of ones around with these wrappers for a long, long time. And uh, I, when I went and I saw these, you know, the only place you can buy these is in a bulk store. So, uh, that I've ever seen, I don't know, maybe, maybe if you're in Italy, you can buy them, you know, regular, but anyway, I, I did figure it out that these are actually Italian, these words are Italian, fragola, means strawberry, um, this is the wildberry line of these, of these candies, by the way, uh, mora means, uh, blackberry, uh, lampon, of course, raspberry, and, uh, the final one, mora, is, uh, or Ribes, sorry, Mora's over there. Ribes, Ribes is current. Um, so you got a blackberry, raspberry, strawberry, and a, and a current uh, in uh, in terms of your flavors of your hard candies. But these are like kind of like the the, the good traditional candies that you'd find, right? Um, at your, I don't know, I, I remember always having hard candies when I was waiting at the hair salon when I was a kid. Or uh, the doctor's office sometimes. Waiting rooms in general. I mean, waiting rooms are not as common a thing, I think, anymore. But um, these ones, and then, you know those ones that are like the hard candies that are like the full, the wrappers, the full strawberry, and then like the tassel is just the green? Oh man, those are the best, with like the soft insides. And as far as I remember, these ones have kind of that softer inside as well. Not the, not the ones with like a juice inside them, but like... I don't know, it's something not like, it's not like hard all the way through, if I remember correctly. Anyway, these come from the Progula Company, an Italian chocolatier, uh, founded in 1907 from Progula, Italy. Um, mm, really good, by the way. You probably know them best for their product line, Baki, or Boki? Boki? Baki? B-O-C-I. Um, and... Uh, I think the Boki is available, sorry if I'm mispronouncing that, I'm not really sure, I don't know that I've ever had it. I think that it's available kind of all over the place. I know that in the last couple of years, I can't get away from seeing them in Canada, and I think that perhaps they've established a Canadian um, like manufacturing center, because that's, I, I gotta think that that's it, because they are all over Canada, especially in um, seasonal, you know, for uh, like, box chocolate, kind of a higher end, higher end chocolate box that you'd find. Really nice design work, really nice, nice packaging. Anyway, nowhere on these packages does it say Pergula, so that's why it makes it a little tough to figure it out, but nice design work. Mmm. Little inner wrapper. And the candy itself, really great flavoring. It's the kind of hard candy that you suck on for a little while, and then you chew into, and you realize, oh, it's not like this solid, hard mass. It's like got some sort of pl ply to it, you know? I think it's got a hollow core, and um, it's not so dense that <clears throat> it's not so dense that you're not going to be able to you know, soften it up just by having it in your mouth. The strawberry flavor is great. Um, I'm a big fan of that. Mm -mm. Very good. Let's try the raspberry. Now, I think these are all the same in terms of like, yeah, the lookers are all, are all the same. Again, I like this design work. It's simple. The, um, the lettering on the name is great. Right? Whoa. 
Sorry, guys. I love that. Uh, I love that look. Oh man, camera just fell. Anyway, let's try the uh, let's try the raspberry. Mm. It's sweet, but it's not over sweet. <clears throat> Sorry, it's hard to eat a hard candy and talk about it. It's got a really strong flavor, but it does not, it's not at all overpowering. It's really the kind of nice, strong but sweet flavor that I like. Something that I would say is akin on a fruit level to, you know, some of my favorite candies like a Skittle. As opposed to some of my least favorite candies like a uh, Jolly Rancher, which I think goes a little too far in terms of the flavoring. Anyway. I really like this. Um, I think that uh, Pergula has done a really good job. You guys probably know these candies, you know? I mean, like, they've been around for quite a while. I gotta say, I am impressed with them. They did a really good job. I like them. Um, I guess I'm gonna call these the Pergula Hard Candy Set, or maybe the Pergula Wildberry Linking Candies. I think that's what those are, are they're actually called. Anyway, Walking the Candy Aisle, I dig them. I'm going to rate them a very strong 4 out of 5. If you're looking for some hard candies, like a big bowl of them to put on your desk at work or something, I think you definitely are going to do well with these. Um, highly recommended. So thanks very much for watching, guys. You let me know in the comments below what your favorite hard candy is. And uh, I hope you're having a good one. I will talk to you soon. Okay, bye-bye.